Okay, continued. So then there's another double door entry. I think at one point this could have been the third car garage. So they have another bonus room out of it. It was probably an option because this faces the front of the house. So it's a good craft room, good whatever room. Then you have this. You want to go down the hallway, take the shortcut. Um, nice size bedroom. Here's the bathroom. Very clean, very nice. Here's another bedroom. Oh, good size bedroom. Tall ceilings. Some hall closet and here is the master. Separate tub shower combo, taller height sinks. Separate commode area and a nice closet. So shutters everywhere. I think it's light and bright. Uh, I don't know if you're gonna love the location. It's really tucked away back, a little off the beaten path. Not terrible, but. And you open these shutters and you can get outside. So small little covered patio here. We have a little bit of furniture. That is tiny, pretty close to the house next door. And so then they extended the patio and put some pergola and misters and some lights. This backyard's really kind of nice. I mean, you do have some nice grass back here. Single story homes all around. It is private. A little bit of mountain view back there. Hmm. This is interesting. I think the house is very well cared for. Built in barbecue, that's old. And again, built in 2003, so you have your dual pane windows. AC unit is, you know, original, but. Okay, this has potential.